Hey guys, welcome to Wrestling Days and welcome to another Mattel figure collection video. This is an update um, and we've not done an update in quite a while. Uh, so let's start by showing off all the names uh, for those subscribers that are in the Wrestling Days Subscribers Hall of Fame. Um, many congratulations to these people. Uh, that is closed at the moment, but it will reopen a little closer to Christmas. So if you're interested in joining, just watch this space um, and information will come through on that a little closer to Christmas. I do need to find a way of making these names stand out better in videos. So I've started trying to outline them, but to be honest, I think I'm going to have to try something else because even they don't stand out that well. But let's go to the top shelf. Let's go to the current roster. Uh, you can see like Hideo Itami and Kevin Owens, Apollo Crews, uh, Tyler Breeze, R-Truth, Dolph Ziggler. Um, you'll see quite a few belts as well. Uh, that's what I started collecting really was the figures that came with championships, that came with belts. Um, I absolutely love the way Mattel make these belts and the detail that goes into the belts. Emma there, uh, looking a little glum, a little sad. Uh, not like Bailey here. Look at Bailey. She's got a big smile on her face. Uh, Becky uh, Grinch next to her, though. Not that happy. Love that Sasha Banks with the shades on. Doesn't look as good without the shades. Uh, the Demon King, Finn Balor. Um, you can see as well the Andre the Giant Memorial Trophy with Baron Corbin. That new Roman Reigns, um, which I think is that Elite 44. Four, I think can't quite remember um, when we're down to the legends shelf I absolutely love this shelf it's absolutely stacked like I really struggle to get any other figures onto it and um, before we move on to that though let's just I would just want to focus on this John Cena because it is um, a ringside exclusive I believe I've got the box down here for it it's a John Cena flashback might have been a Toys R Us exclusive actually um, but it comes with like uh, a spinner belt and a spinner us title as well it's really cool and he comes in this like debut attire i think we have looked at it before but i've never done a review on him and i keep meaning to do a review on him so before we move on that is the current roster shelf so let's go down to the legends shall we uh so on the legends shelf you can see davy boy and ryback got Rey Mysterio, uh, another Rey Mysterio, we got Yokozuna, and I can't see who that is, even I can't remember who that is, is that Ringmaster? I think it is, yeah, that's the Ringmaster, because it's got the million dollar belt, I see Lex Luger as well, the Narcissist hiding back there, Sting and Terry Funk, Junkyard Dog, uh, Ricky the Dragon, um, so yeah, again, you know, I, I try and get the championships, but I gotta be honest, if I if I don't get championships, then I love getting legends like classic superstars. Um, and there's some greats here like Sean and Razor, Lita, uh, as well. Um, I can see Kane, a couple of Canes. We'll get to that Kane in a minute. Hulk there, hulking up. <laughs> Shockmaster, obviously, as well, signed. And there's, you know, one of the greatest legends, Bruno Sammartino. We've got the big boss man and Triple H. And look at that warrior. I love that warrior. Um, and Undertaker hiding there. And there's another Undertaker. I heard as well that there's, um, apparently, you see the colour pink, like, just before you die, uh, which I thought was interesting. I don't know why I'm telling you that. I think it's because the Undertaker's on the shelf, but... Look, we got Kamala! Awesome. And right next to him, we've got Umaga! And we've got The Rock. And we've got Macho Man. Um, it doesn't look like Macho Man's happy. It looks like he's being forced to sniff the rock's armpit. <laughs> uh, we got Kane with that hardcore title, um, which is really cool. Um, so I really like that belt. We, I th we have done a review of that one, though. And then we've got Trish and Vicky Guerrero. And then we're down here onto the tag team shelf. You got the shield, uh, which is really cool. We got the Bushwhackers. Um, and you can see Million Dollar Man and IRS. You've got Dudley Boys, and we've got uh, the Heart Foundation, Edge and Christian, D Generation X, 
I need to see if there's any more. I think like I think Road Dog comes with the DX top, which I need to get. We've got Lucha Dragons and APA. We've got the NWO. Look at that. We've got. Do you remember when Titus and Darren Young were friends? <laughs> uh, do you remember when Cody Rhodes Stardust had a job with WWE? Uh, we've got Vaude Villains. We've got the men are here. We got the new day. Look how happy Biggie is. Love that face scan. Absolutely brilliant. New day rocks. New day rocks. We got the nasty boys as well. Awesome. So that's the tag team shelf. Could probably do with a few more teams on there actually. So I'm looking forward to Alpha and the Revival and Harlem Heat. But those are the three main shelves. Um, and I'm adding to them all the time. Down here we've got pop vinyls. Uh, which uh, used to live up on the top, but I just ran out of room. I haven't looked at that Ultimate Warrior yet or that Ric Flair, um, but both of them look really cool. Got Andre the Giant and The Rock and uh, Rey Mysterio. These are empty boxes. That's if ever I need to make another shelf for figures. I've got boxes ready to go. I think there's a few figures in these, though, that I need to review. I've still got Tito, Santana and Godfather and Mizdow. I keep getting asked to review Mizdow. Apologies, I am sorry for not doing that yet. I just it's just finding the time. Um, and we've got Kane as well, uh, or the Kane box, I should say. That's the box for the Kane that we saw with the, the hardcore title. That's a ringside exclusive. Um, and as I say, we have done a review on that already. Um, basics we've got Paige, this is my house. <laughs> uh, we've got oh, Jesus Christ, I'm not interested in that one. Um, we've got you just the honky tonk man. Man, just the honky tonk man. Uh, oh, and we've got the uh, invisible man there. That's awesome. Got an elite of the invisible man. Uh, we got Seamus Fella. Look at that. That's a good face scan, actually. I, I should review that. I've, I've not reviewed a Seamus yet. Uh, that's an awful face scan. I don't like that at all. I don't think that's very good, John Cena. Um, so, yeah, not, not keen on that one. Uh, we've got Naomi. That's cool, isn't it? Um, yeah, re do you know, I really like that attire. Uh, again, I should review it. Um, we've got, yeah, this cost me about 30-odd pounds, this did. Um, but it's really cool because it comes with that winged eagle. Um, and uh, I think it was an exclusive, like Kmart maybe? Um, but yeah, there was only three in this series. Uh, Daniel Bryan and Bad News Barrett and The Ultimate Warrior. So yeah, I like that. This is a better John Cena. I like the face scan on this John Cena. Um, and he's got a cool orange top as well. So um, yeah, I liked that. And look at that. You've got the great Carly. Absolutely huge uh, figure, this one. Uh, again, I, I need to get this one reviewed because I just think this would look really cool on the shelf. Although, I don't know if it would stand up that well. Other ones in the series, Big Show, Dolph Ziggler, Great Carly, CM Punk, Tamina Snooker, and first time in the line, Dean Ambrose. That's how old this figure is. Uh, first time in the line for Dean Ambrose. Cool, so those are all the basics. i uh, got a few books and magazines, including that Greatest 100 Matches, Tagged Classics, uh, a few wrestling DVDs there as well. Uh, we've got that Contract Chaos, which we did a review of not too long ago, which was really cool. Um, we've got uh, Jack Swagger, Zeb Coulter Battle Pack. Uh, there's an Adam Rose and Bunny Battle Pack there as well. And then at the moment, that's where all my zombies are kept. Uh, all my zombie figures just shoved back there because I've literally got no more room um and that is it guys that is the mattel figure collection at the moment i've only been collecting look at this mess as well oh, i've got to tidy all this up i'll probably leave it um but yeah the uh i've only been collecting this year i only started like 11 months ago so uh yeah i'm really pleased with how it's progressed so far but as i said i love seeing your collections please keep sending me uh clips and videos of uh what you've got uh, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Really appreciate it. Give the video a like if you liked it. Hit the subscribe if you haven't already. Bye for now.